In today's video, I want to show you how you can script your YouTube videos more effectively. What's up guys, my name is Justin and welcome back to my channel where we make little changes with huge impacts on our lives. If you're new here, I upload videos with different tips and tricks to help you improve your life, so please consider subscribing. Whether you are a veteran YouTuber or a newbie like me, it can be very nerve wracking when it comes to posting your videos. Is the content good? Does it make sense? Am I presenting it well? How's my hair? How's my beard? Your goal is to get your viewers interested and keep them interested throughout the entire video. I have found that scripting my videos is a great way to reduce the added stress when it comes to recording my videos. Even a simple script will help you keep your thoughts and ideas organized and it will help you deliver your message in the most efficient and effective way as possible. Once you have figured out the topic that you want to discuss in your videos, it is time to break it down into four different sections. Number one is going to be the hook. Number two is the intro. Number three is the body. And number four is the call to action. I like to think of the hook as the quick what of your video. At the beginning of your video, quickly tell your viewers what your video is going to be about. Your goal is to grab the viewer's attention and keep them long enough so they want to watch the rest of your video. So for example, this was my hook. In today's video, I want to show you how you can script your YouTube videos more effectively. And now your hook is going to be different for every video. It really depends on what you are talking about. So for example, yours might be, in today's video, I'm going to teach you how to put on pants. Or it might be this. In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to make a ham sandwich. And if your viewers want to learn how to make that sandwich, they're probably going to stick around and watch. So whatever your video is going to be about, let them know as quick as possible. And now that you've got them hooked and you've grabbed their attention, let's move on to the introduction. I like to think of the intro as the who of the video. It is where you're going to quickly tell your viewers who you are and give them a little more detail on what the video is actually about. I personally like to explain what my channel is about. That way, if my viewers have not subscribed yet, hopefully they will. What's up guys, my name is Justin and welcome back to my channel where we make little changes with huge impacts on our lives. If you're new here, I upload videos with different tips and tricks to help you improve your life, so please consider subscribing. And now you don't need an introduction to your video, you can jump right into the content if you want, but that is totally up to you. The introduction is a great way to lead your viewers to the information and reinforce why they should stick around and watch your video. And once the introduction is out of the way, we can now head into the body of your video. I like to think of the body as the big what of your video. This is going to be the content of your video. This is the reason the viewer clicked on your video to begin with. This is where you're going to share all the details and information on your topic. This is the most important section of your video. This is the reason the viewers clicked your video. It is very easy to get off topic and ramble when you're making your videos. So I would suggest you use a script or bullet points to help you stay on topic. Your script or bullet points should include the main points you want to discuss in the correct order so you can stay on track. And how many points you have in your script is totally up to you. It's really dependent on the topic you want to talk about. Using a script or bullet points will help prevent you from repeating something you've already said earlier in your video. And it is very important that you stick to your list. This will make the editing process a lot easier because it will allow you to move or remove something in your video. Write out your topics so they flow easy and practice. Take some time before you record your video to talk out what you're going to say. The words might look good on paper, but when you actually talk them out loud, you will know whether the words flow together or not. So now that you've discussed what your video is going to be about, what do you want your viewers to do? This is the call to action. Depending on what your video is about, your call to action could be several things. It could be go buy this product. Check out my website in the description below. Like me on Facebook. Or a simple comment down below 
an answer to the question I just asked. I always like to end my videos with a call to action to have my viewers comment down below so I can interact with them in the comment section. And I always like to ask them to please subscribe to my channel if they haven't yet so they don't miss out on any of the videos I'm posting. I like to ask a question because it guides my viewers into a comment. I'm not just asking them to comment something randomly. I'm giving them a question and having them answer it. The call to action could be included in your intro, the body, or at the end of the video. It's all up to you. I personally would recommend you include a closing call to action. What exactly do you want your viewers to do once they finish watching your video? Later in the video, I'm going to ask you to comment down below with whether or not you script your videos. I like to remind my viewers at the end of my video, that way they do not forget. I would hate for the next video to play and this video get lost in YouTube land forever. All right, so that's gonna do it for today's video. If you found any value in this, then please throw me a thumbs up and comment down below whether or not you script your videos. See, I told you I was gonna say that. And if you haven't yet, please hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of my videos. I'm coming at you with different tips and tricks to help you improve your life, so don't miss any of them. And as always, let's keep growing.